Hi, I'm Dave Altavilla for Hot Hardware. Today we'll continue our coverage in small form factor systems with a look at the Dell Studio Hybrid. Now as the name suggests, the Studio Hybrid is a low profile system that consumes a lot less power than a full size desktop but maintains all the features and functionalities. In addition, it's possible that this machine could double nicely as a home theater PC. Let's take a look around at this eco-friendly machine from Dell. The Dell Studio Hybrid is a small form factor system that weighs in at just under 5 pounds and measures only about 8.5 inches tall. Dell bills the hybrid as one of its most environmentally friendly machines that consumes 70% less power than a typical desktop, meets Energy Star Standard 4.0 compliance, and has a power supply with an 87% efficiency rating. In addition, the hybrid's packaging is made from 95% recyclable materials. And Dell also ships with the system a system recycling kit for your old system, which is essentially a prepaid ground service delivery tag back to Dell so that Dell can dispose of your old system in an environmentally friendly way. Our studio hybrid came built upon an Intel 965 chipset with integrated X3100 graphics and an Intel Core 2 Duo T5850 dual core processor clocked at 2.16 GHz. We also had installed 3 GB of DDR2-667 system memory and a standard 5400 RPM 160 GB hard drive. We also had an 8X slot load CD-DVD combo drive in our machine, but Dell also offers options for a 6X slot load Blu-ray drive as well. Operating system choices include Microsoft Windows Vista Home Basic, Home Premium, and Vista Ultimate. On the front of the system, you can see we have an integrated multi-format flashcard reader slot, a pair of USB slots, and a headphone jack slot. And of course, we have our slot load combo DVD CD drive. The back side of the Dell Studio Hybrid has lots of different I.O. options. Starting from top to bottom here, you can see we have our power jack, our gigabit ethernet LAN port, HDMI output, DVI video output, three USB 2.0 ports, 1394 Firewire, SPDIF optical output, microphone in, and audio output line out. So let's power on the Dell Studio Hybrid and see what she's made of. As you can see, the hybrid logo nicely illuminated through the front panel of the system, as well as the power button. I think you saw the hard drive indicator light flash there as well and in a moment you'll see there's an optical drive indicator light that also doubles as a touch button for the slot load DVD drive and as you can see the Dell logo also nicely illuminated through the side panel of the system again real sleek stylings with the Dell Studio Hybrid as a reminder this system is built on an Intel Core 2 Duo dual core processor with 3 gig of system memory and a standard 5400 RPM hard drive. So, Windows Vista boot times as well as general desktop responsiveness should be competitive with a full size system. And as you can see, we've gotten to a Vista desktop in well under 30 seconds. Let's have a look around. Our Dell Studio Hybrid came pre configured with Microsoft Windows Vista Home Premium. And the first thing you'll notice is that Dell includes a handy multimedia toolbar bundled in with the OS. And this toolbar provides functionality for email, internet, photos, music, video, security, and other features. Taking a look down here at the Vista Experience Index, we see Vista rates the Studio Hybrid 140G that we have a Windows Experience Index of 3 and our Intel Core 2 Duo processor T5850 at 2.16 GHz is listed here as well as 3 GB of system memory and of course this is a 32-bit installation of Windows Vista Home Premium. Another important utility that Dell includes with the Studio Hybrid is Dell Media Direct Home and this is a multimedia viewer slash player of sorts giving you access to your digital pictures, music, and of course digital video. We're gonna fire up the video player and our DVD movie of choice. In this case, Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest. And as you can see, playing standard definition digital video is not a problem. Fluid and smooth. And CPU utilization currently 
oscillating between 15 to 20 percent. Let's do a little bit of multitasking. We'll browse through some web pages. And as you can see, CPU utilization spikes from that 20 percent or so up to 70 percent. But also, of course, the uh, DVD video remains smooth and fluid in the background. So good multitasking performance here, playing digital video and browsing web pages simultaneously. Let's take a look at high definition digital video next. Now one of the areas of concern with a small form factor system like the Dell Studio Hybrid, which could also double nicely as a home theater PC, would be its ability to play back high definition digital video. In this case, the system's chipset with onboard graphics only has the ability to partially offload the host processor for digital video processing. Let's fire up a 720p resolution high definition clip. And as you can see, CPU utilization over here on Windows Task Manager Performance Monitor is showing 30 to 40%. And the video plays back smoothly and fluidly. Next, we'll fire up a 1080p clip. A little bit more work for the Dell Studio Hybrid. And as you can see, CPU utilization has spiked up a little bit more now. We're reporting 40 to maybe 65% or so. But the video does play back smooth and fluid with no drop frames. And we should note that we had to disable DirectX processing in the Windows Media Player Options menu in order to get these 1080p clips to play cleanly in Windows Media Player. The reason for this, frankly, is that Intel's chipset drivers still need a little bit of optimization. But Dell's Media Direct Home player utility did a nice job of playing these clips and also will serve as the media player for Blu-ray DVDs as a Blu-ray player is also an option with the Studio Hybrid. Now during testing we found that the Dell Studio Hybrid consumed about 28 watts of power under idle conditions and about 63 watts of power under full load. Not bad for a system with its capabilities. In addition, Dell also offers interchangeable outer sleeves for the Studio Hybrid which allow you to change colors. And there's even a bamboo sleeve if you're really feeling earthy crunchy. The base price for the Studio Hybrid is $499 on Dell's site and with additional options like Blu-ray players and 802.11n wireless Prices can go northward from there. Stop by the site for the full review. I'm Dave Altavilla for Hot Hardware. Thanks for stopping by.